We're building a combination bookshelf and speaker stand. The next step is to sand the wood down, cut it into pieces, and fit things together. That's all coming up right now! Okay, the board looks pretty at that end. Not so pretty at this end. But there's uh, a lot of damage here. It's from not being taken care of during... Wow, that, that actually is worse. <laughs> okay, well... I'll bet you a sander can do a lot of cleaning up. So we'll just take a sander tit and see what we can do with it. And uh, and after that, we're just uh, I mean, obviously these are going to be the outsides. And uh, we'll take a sander on this. It looks like it's all dried out, whatever it is. So. Um, <laughs> Now the first thing I'm going to do, and I've already kind of put a line here, and you uh, may or may not be able to see this, but I've done it in pencil, and I have a very thin blade, it's a, and a very high quality blade on my saw, and what this very first cut here is going to do, as you can see this, this, this board is not perfectly straight on the end, so I put uh, I'm going to cut off, I mean, this is a sacrificial sliver, and I've marked it where it's going to cut, right here. And um, I think I'm probably going to try and cut through that line right there. And, of course, I've checked it both ways, and you can see I'm using a square to, to see, um, you know, I'm assuming that I've got a pretty straight board. If I don't have a pretty straight board, then we're going to be in trouble. I'm going to make sure that everything is lined up over there. Pull that over there, push that down, and uh, I can look at that and I can say, well, it's just pretty, so if it's not perfect, it's pretty close. Gotta get the right. probably worse than what I started out with. It's uh, basically, yeah, it's kind of sort of straight. 
So let's go ahead and now there are marks here to tell me where the blade is, but I'm not going to pay attention to that. I'm going to be looking at the blade. Okay, so I'm going to cut the rest of these. I'm going to cut three sixteens, and then uh, the very last ones are going to be two thirty sixes. All right, so um, one part I didn't show you before was to um, was I take the three steps and I clamp them together as closely as I can. Um, mark, uh, get one edge cleaned up, and then get another edge lined up, lined up and lined up. So I get this edge lined up and then get this edge lined up and then of course uh, what, I, what I'm doing here is um, this, this lined up at the bottom sending a flat surface here and all these three are lined up and then they're never perfectly the same so what I'll do is just sand getting them lined up and then of course after I get done with that um, take off one clamp at a time and move it around make sure nothing changes and um, you notice this is on the bottom because this is the bed uh, I'm putting a clamp on the bottom but on the top where it's going to be able to visible um, I, I've got a protection board for the clamps and of course the same thing move the clamps around one at a time and uh, sand. So I've already done the sanding. I'm just showing you what I did. Um, sanding the edges down so that everything is uh, going to be below the top there. Um, and then just sand them down. And what that does is it helps to make sure everything is pretty close. Even if it's not close, you, you'll get it uh, a little bit close. You, you see, these these are not perfect, um, but they're they're close enough. Um, and the and it doesn't really matter that I um, if I get these um, a little bit. Um, shorter all over, even if it's 16 minus 1 eighth or a 16th of an inch shorter because of sanding, because they're all going to be the same, so they'll all fit for there. I'll take these two, these are the sides, and I'll also take these and I'll clamp them up and I'll sand down the edges and get them to match up and, and work nice and pretty. Now I'm going to just look real quick at how this is going to go. This side piece. This is the back piece right here, and you'll be able to see what that looks like in a second here. And it's a really pretty piece of wood. It's it's a um, plywood, but um, yeah. so I've cut all these pieces. These are all 16. So this is 16, 16, 16, 16. Um, everything here is. Um, so 11 and 1 quarter inches uh, wide, except for this is 16 inches wide, and uh, all the tall pieces are 34 and 1 half inches piece, uh, uh, 1 half inches tall, including this piece of wood right here. Thanks for watching my program. If you like my videos, be sure and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And for an organized listing of my YouTube videos, go to my website www.wheremyplacebos.com and click on videos. Have a great day. See you.